Hey wonderful people of YouTube, Th welcome back to my channel once again. I hope you're all doing fine despite the ongoing wrath of 2020. But today I'm going to talk to you about my five... Oops. <laughs> Using this DJI Ronin S. Um, I had this last year. So originally I was planning to make my 10 favorite gimbal moves but unfortunately I failed to do the rest of them but don't worry I'll probably um, update this on another video later on so what I'm about to show you are very very simple gimbal moves that could definitely definitely make your um, short films or documentaries or even music videos etc epic so without further ado let's do my five personal favorite gimbal moves But first, click on the subscribe button and turn the notification bell. Game. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Richard. And today we're going to use my DJI Ronin S for the first time. And we're gonna do some 5 favorite standard gimbal moves. And here with me is Jochan, our model today. And she's also a YouTuber, so check out her channel, Jochan. <laughs> That's it guys, so let's go. So number one, follow shot. So this is a standard shot. As the name suggests, follow your subject at a constant speed, pace and distance. Keep your movement smooth and consistent and keep your subject in the center of the frame. Make sure your tilt is locked, meaning that it will not move up and down by pressing and holding down the front trigger while walking. You could also try the side follow shot while maintaining the subject in the center of the frame. Number two, under slant. In order to do this, you have to set your gimbal to under slant mode. Press the front trigger button and hold and turn your gimbal upside down on its X axis or parallel to your body. This is one of the greatest mode DJI Ronin S have. And then take any shot on the lower portion of the subject. For this example, we are taking the shot of our subject's, subject's feet or shoes as she walks in forward. Number 3. Barrel Mode or Flashlight Mode so this is a shot where we roll the camera 360 degrees. Shots like these have specific application. So this mode is also known as the inception shot as most likely this will make the audience dizzy. For this shot, we have set our gimbal into infinite roll. Again, this is one of the coolest feature with DJI Ronin S. And to do that, first we need to set one of the modes in our gimbal into roll. I have reserved my M1 or my first mode into flashlight. Turn the channel 3 into roll and leave channel 1 and 2 into NA. Then hold your gimbal like how you hold a flashlight. Double tap the front trigger and now you can make your gimbal roll infinitely. Now on the scene, turn your joystick to the left or to the right and hold it until you finish shooting while walking towards your subject.
Number 4 Orbital or revolving So this shot is just to go around our subject And this is the camera movement that is being used a lot in Hollywood films And this is also one of my absolute favorite It introduces the subject as well as the background I'd like to focus on the subject Ready, but at the same go. time you want to take a shot of its surroundings Thus you need to rotate or revolve around your subject Be sure to experiment with the distance around your subject But I like to keep the distance constant as much as possible A lookup angle would also be nice but that is not shown here And lastly, the jeep or the crane shot. This shot is from top to bottom revealing our subject. We'll start with the shot hiding behind a blurry object and slowly revealing the subject from afar. This shot resembles that of a massive production using a jeep and the camera being mounted on it. It is important to note to set your focus on the subject and lock it manually before starting the shot. So there you have it guys, I hope you like my 5 simple gimbal moves that will make your footage cinematic or epic. Until then, be safe and peace out.